Now, if you do have a reef aquarium, never aim for zero nitrates or phosphates because nitrates and phosphates is needed by your corals. Now, with some of the nitrate and phosphate removers on the market now, zero nitrate and phosphate is a reality but it's really not your aim. You really wanna make sure that there is some nitrate and phosphate in the um, water for your corals to thrive on. But you also wanna be careful what test kits you're using because various brands are just not um, gonna test low enough to ensure that you can tell whether you've got no nitrate or phosphate or an acceptable low level. So you're definitely gonna wanna keep your nitrate and pho phosphate well below one part per million, but you definitely don't want zero. So getting a low reading test would be a very good idea. Something that has measurements underneath one so like for example this one's very good that's giving 0 0.1 0 0.2 so that's very good but you don't want zero now a lot of the nitrate and phosphate removers on the market strip the water very powerfully and can leave you with not enough nitrate and phosphate so just be aware that all of these nitrate and phosphate removers, such as this, you do not want to add them if your nitrate level or phosphate level doesn't require them. Do not add them for no reason. There are downsides. Please comment.